one thing I always was brought up with and I had a desire to and that was to work hard and, and earn money and try and be successful in whatever I did. That just was always work work orientated, you know, it was how my dad, my mum my and my dad, but my dad really instructed that into me from an early age. I think that's where the passion's grown from is just pleasing people and, and now I've got this, you know, this restaurant in a beautiful area with beautiful ingredients um, and to me that uh, that's all that's all I need to get passionate about and the rest sort of just flows into place of making sure I have a successful business. The food has changed and evolved so much and the style of food of where we're at right now is you know I love it I love what we do um, it's big bold flavours it's 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 just really all about the ingredients a lot more simple um, and it's fun in its approach and I think it's a just think it's a really nice kind of style of dining, I really do. Reggiano's in the Square is another restaurant um, that I have, which I make clear from the start, I do not cook there. I cook at Paul Ainsworth at number six, that's where my name is. It's, it's my ideas, it's my, it's my inspiration, it's my passion for Italian food. Um, I think it's a, a fantastic place to go and just chill out and watch Padstow go by and have a great time. So. We did some um, sort of training with the boys. We're just working on like a sourdough pizza at the moment, which I'm trying to run across the board for all of our pizzas, making a sourdough base. Um, we looked at a couple of new dishes. Um, got some great young lads that are energetic, and these boys are thinking like that. They're passionate. They got they're full of energy. So that was brilliant. Then after that, we went with again a very good friend of mine, Padstow legend. Um, and that's Brian Bate. Um, I met Brian when I first moved down here. He was one of the local locals that made me feel really welcome. I've never met anyone like Brian. He lives off the land. Um, so as far as Brian's concerned, you know, if it's within reason, if it's, if it's walking and it's normally four legs, he shoots it. And that's kind of, that's what I love about him. His main um, job is um, lobster, lobster fisherman. Um, and today we captured going out in the lobster season just coming to the end. So right now Brian's going out every day and he builds up 20 ton of herrings in his, um, in his basically his lockup. Um, so yeah, it's been a really, really brilliant day. I've loved it. <laughs>